Jan Sanders Van Hemessen, a leading Flemish Renaissance painter, was born in 1500. He belonged to a group of Italianizing Flemish painters called the Romanists, who were influenced by Italian Renaissance painting. Van Hemessen's artistic journey took him to Italy in the 1520s and to Fontainebleau near Paris in the mid-1530s. During these visits, he had the opportunity to observe and be inspired by the works of Italian artists at the first school of Fontainebleau, who were creating decorations for the Palace of Fontainebleau. Van Hemessen demonstrated his ability to interpret Italian models by incorporating them into a new Flemish visual style. One of Van Hemessen's significant contributions was in the development of genre painting. His large-scale scenes depicted religious or worldly subjects set in contemporary towns with contemporary dress and architecture. These works often portrayed human flaws such as greed and vanity, and some explored subjects with a financial aspect. Van Hemessen's genre scenes pioneered the Mannerist inversion style, later expanded upon by Peter Ertzen. In this style, a small religious scene in the background reveals the true meaning of the painting, while the foreground scene focuses on secular genre subjects. The Parable of the Prodigal Son is one of his most renowned works, blending a religious theme with a genre painting set in a tavern. It can be seen as an important early example of the Merry Company tradition. Additionally, Van Hemessen painted a small number of portraits, influenced by Bronzino, some of which were of exceptional quality. He also explored the subject of large nude figures, which he had familiarized himself with during his time in Italy. Jan Sanders Van Hemessen's early career and influences Jan Sanders Van Hemessen, born in Hemixem, was an apprentice of Hendrik van Cleve I in Antwerp. In the early 1520s, he traveled to Italy, where he studied classical antiquity models like the Laocoon and the works of Michelangelo and Raphael. Returning to Antwerp in 1524, he became a master in the local guild of St. Luke. Jan Sanders Van Hemessen's life and family Van Hemessen is believed to have worked at the royal court in Mechelen and may have encountered Jan Gossert, a court painter, and the master of the legend of the Magdalene. It is unclear whether he spent time in Harlem, as mentioned by biographer Karel Van Mander. Van Hemessen was married to Barbara de Fevre and had two daughters. After his wife's death, he had an illegitimate son named Peter with his maid Bet Ken. His daughter Katharina Van Hemessen also became a successful portrait painter. Jan Sanders Van Hemessen's legacy The details of Van Hemessen's death remain unknown. However, he left a lasting impact on the art world. He trained his daughter Katharina, who became a renowned portrait painter. Van Hemessen's works showcased his mastery of various subjects, including religious scenes, allegorical scenes, and portraits. His paintings continue to be admired for their attention to detail, vibrant colors, and emotional depth. In conclusion, Jan Sanders Van Hemessen was a prominent Flemish Renaissance painter who made significant contributions to the art world. His ability to blend Italian influences with a new Flemish visual style showcased his skill and creativity. Van Hemessen's pioneering work in genre painting, particularly the Mannerist inversion style, set the stage for future artists like Peter Ertzen. His renowned painting, The Parable of the Prodigal Son, exemplifies his mastery in combining religious themes with secular genre subjects. Van Hemessen's exploration of portraits and large nude figures further demonstrated his versatility as an artist. His legacy lives on through his daughter Katharina, who also became a successful portrait painter. Van Hemessen's attention to detail, vibrant colors, and emotional depth continue to captivate audiences today.